Hi, Rumians. I'm Drushnik. Thank you for being here and welcome back to another episode of A Rumi Corp in Stellaris Megacorp. <laughs> um, we have new planets. Three in total. Two new sectors. I am thinking... Actually, no, I'm, I have to keep them. I was thinking maybe I could give them to... Um, to the Kraxras, for example, and and reduce my administrative sprawl that way, but do, 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 I might actually keep them. We will need a governor, though. Shmoopy Trop? Shmoopy Trop? Let's do Shmoopy Trop. <laughs> Good name. Yep. And then you also need a governor. Um, lower crime? Food from jobs. Extra food. Wagutrim. Sure. Installing new governors in three, two, one. Okay, so this planet needs housing. So let's build a city district. Will that give enough housing though? Yes, plus eight. It will. These are pretty small planets now. I mean, I bombed all of them. Is that why? 63% devastation. Ouch. Yeah. Migration. Sactic Zakax looks pretty good, though. This is going to be fixed. Um, this planet is really fine. They have a lot of jobs. Job openings. So I don't really need to do anything here. Hazardous weather. Habitability minus 10%, happiness minus 5, but more energy credits and more max generator districts, okay? Do you have any blockers? Yes, you do. Impassable mountains. Let's make them passable. You also have impassable mountains. Not any longer! Okay, so with the war ended, let's send you back for repairs. Ooh. And uh, we have a new faction, the Freedom Organization. Okay. Actually, you come back to uh, Arumis. And then, hang on. Let's, let's look at that faction, though. What's that? Starbase is not connected to the trade network. Really? Oh, yeah, because you're new. How did I fix that last time? I don't remember. Iria Moon, same thing. Does it fix itself over time? I don't remember. Oh, I have too many star bases though. Hang on. Uh, let's get rid of Omagus. And... We could get rid of Vilith. We don't need Vilith. Actually, trade value in Hishmal. Uh, one, two, three. Or two from Unatra. We could use Unatra for that. Two trade hubs. We don't need Vilith. Or I could get rid of Uproth, really. But that's already a pretty good starbase. Let's keep it. It's near the core of my territory. Um, yeah, let's get rid of Vilith. Oops. Okay, good. And then Unatra, you need to get rid of... Uh, let's replace it with a trade hub. And this one as well. And then we'll be collecting the four value from Hishmal. Yeah, that's fine. Then we have the Meow Ouchers. Where are you guys? You're over there. You're flying back to get repaired in Unatra. And the Claude Armada is coming back and the Bleak... Beaked Glory is already returning. Good, 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 good. Uh, oh yeah, the faction. Freedom Organization. Aggressive Diplomacy. Conquest. Neighbor neighborhood Rivalries. No, 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 that's the wrong one. Anti-Autocratic. Free Movement. Effects Faction. What do you want? Prohibiting Forced Resettlement. Uh, no. Reproductive Freedoms. Okay. Anti-Stratification. Well, I'm not going to keep them happy, I don't think. Not too happy, at least. I got an insult. 
Rumi Corp product, straight from the bargain bin to the garbage bin. Ha <laughs> ha, you're so funny, man. You're so funny. That makes me laugh. There's no way you're as strong as I am, so... Just saying. Who are you? Oh. And they're gone. <laughs> um... Zoblar. So now I have the Rigan Commerce Exchange in my territory, which I like. What we'll do is we'll add a trade hub. Is that what we need here? I actually don't know. Let's see if it works. Um, I just need to add the... Oh, I need to change the... That's the thing what I need to do. Um, I need to... Um, Look at the trade routes, and then let's see. Can I? How does it work again? I don't remember. I, I do remember that last time. There. Aha! So are you now part of the? Yes, you are. Okay, and you, you go there, and then you go there. So now it's fixed, right? Now we just have Unatra, that's not part of the network. So you go there. Haha, -ha, that's how you do it. Okay, but you have, so I've already, no. I, where was I building? On Zoblar, okay. So let's build on Iriamun. Gun, missile, hanger, hanger. And Yel Barasta needs gun, missile, hanger, hanger. Okay. Um, Imagine the profit margins ooh. on this tech. Planet build speed plus 50%. Very good. Let's go for the Stormfire Auto Cannon. Now, what we really need to do is we need to. Um, Prepare to weather the storm, basically. With the endgame crisis drawing near. Um, I, I actually was looking at the Rumian hierarchy. Uh, because I'm, I'm preparing a Funniest Moments video, which, by the way, is a lot of work. Um, Blissful Kitty had, had already warned me about that, but uh, it is a lot of work. But anyway, um, so I was looking at, at Rumian hierarchy, and I was, I was at a... Um, episode that is very close to to this one in terms of, of timing and by then I had at least two 60k fleets <laughs> so remember how I was talking about that it feels that in the newer Stellaris the fleets are all smaller well that's because they are I'm pretty sure they are so I, I don't know if the endgame crisis has scaled appropriately I hope so but if not, then we will be in trouble when 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 it hits. Because I don't. <laughs> I think I had two 60k fleets and one small fleet like this, 20 20 something k. And now I have two 20, let's say an average 25k fleets and one small 12 and a half k. Construction complete. Fleet. So that that is a really big difference. Um. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> so. <laughs> I don't know. I hope that um, I hope we can uh, we can manage to uh, stay alive, basically. Technology acquired. So we have habitability modification. Difficult word. We could go for gargantuan evolution. Energy credits from jobs was five percent. We don't really need it. Uh, I really need to increase my storage here again for the minerals. I kind of feel like going for nutrient replication food from jobs plus 15% because we still have minus 33 food. But society research would also be good. Nerve dampeners, army health. Uh, let's go for the food. What can I do to reduce minerals? Do you have anything that I can build using minerals? Not that much. Oh, whoa. Eight unemployed workers this time. That's really bad. 
That is so bad. Maybe we should resettle them? I mean, we have new planets they can go to. They could all go to Yorksakrop, for example. Elnyad. Let's uh, resettle you. Some of you, at least. You might not be happy there, though. Hang on, what kind of world is that? Ocean world. So we should probably not send the Rumi there, but the Cracks Ross would be fine. You should be able to see the habitability percentage for these pops if you... Or can I... Oh, there we go. Uh, York's a crop. For... Oh, Cracks Ross is 35%. Okay, Racket or Ketling? Or Hijam? Oh, ah! Um, so Ketling then. Go. That's at least one. Oh, that's really not that good, is it? Uh, what about... Hmm. Free jobs here. Same thing, though. Racket and Ketling. That's... That's not good. Um... 35%. Hmm. Hmm. Twenty-five. So they they are be best off in Yorksa Crop and in Pask Jatori. I'm gonna send some off anyway. I'm sorry. There we go. So Elnyath now has four unemployed workers, which is still not good, but it's better than more. <laughs> um, Litavox Grime, I think, has unemployed robots. Yeah, so that's okay. I mean, we could, uh... We could resettle them to those planets. Pask to Tori. We've got uh, an unemployed robotic servant. There we go. Gone. From Litterbox Grime. And then in the Vite, we also have robots. So, you could go to Yorksa Crop. There we go. That's better. And now, we suddenly have 22 pops here. Um, let's get... Wait, you already have a heritage a heritage site. Okay. Maybe need to get rid of that. Um, let's see. We should do something about amenities here first, I think. So... Hollow theaters? There we go. Then... Yeah, we'll see what that does to the planet. Okay, my fleets are returning. Let's see what they come out as when we um, upgrade them. Let's look at the fleet manager, though, because I think I have more command limit. Oh, you're over your limit? Boom. How did that happen? We built something. That's weird. The Quad Armada has room for a Titan. Maybe? No, because that's 15. So you're gonna have to wait. But you have room for a Titan. I need to make a second Titan. Because you can only have one Titan, one aura in every full, uh, one aura in total. And the rest won't count. That's that's what it, how it works. So the Titan that we have right now has the targeting grid. Let's make a new one. Titan Bow, Titan Core, Titan Stern. Let's give you the... Inspiring Presence, ship fire rate plus 5%. And we'll give you the Perdition Beam, of course. And then here... This was the shield damage thing, right? So we'll put you in the middle. 
and we'll add some neutron launchers. And then in the back, uh, yeah, some plasma cannons. That would be fine. I think that's okay. Oops, I wanted it here. There we go, and then the shields. And then we'll go for afterburners, auxiliary fire control, and regenerative hull tissue. And you can be Rumi Corp. Were you defensive or ship fire rate? Fire rate, blah, blah, blah. So we'll add you to the oops, fleet manager to the beak glory. You should be fi oh you're sixteen. Okay, hang on. Let's get rid of a uh, destroyer. There we go. Great. And we'll add another corvette. Oh, research grants edict is gone again. But we can renew it. <laughs> this time we can. And oh, we can't do this yet. But we also don't have all the um, traditions unlocked yet. I don't think we're earning as much unity either, are we? As in the previous Stellaris installments. I feel like we're not. Upra, do you have those defense? Yeah. Okay, fine. Upgrade them. Um, Kelsim. We really push the envelope on these ships. Hydroponics Bay. I want resource silos. And then... Two hangar bays. So you'll be slightly defensive, too. Okay. Can War you... declared. Oh. War declared. Hang on. We could stop pop growth here, but nah. That would defeat all purposes, wouldn't it? I think it would. Paradise Dome does not add any jobs. This do though, oh no, that's manager jobs. That's definitely not a worker class. <laughs> um, yeah, not much we can do. War between the Yuri Star and the Kroll Citizen Alliance. Good. More discord. Uh-oh. Even as widening social rifts manifest on York's crop, local communities are galvanized by the upheaval and united by a common desire for greater equality. Ship status cutting edge. Yeah, oh, that stability is pretty bad. Stability. Let's declare martial law here. For now. Because we don't want anything to happen over here. We're working on it, man. You gotta give me some time. I just conquered you. You should be happy. You are part of a better empire now. <laughs> okay. Meowchers can be... Oh, no. You're waiting to be upgraded. You are currently upgraded. Oh, you just were upgraded. Claude Armada? No, you are being upgraded. And the Beak Glory? Where are you? In Strom. How about you go back to Kraz? I want to reinforce you, but I want to reinforce my main fleets first. So... I'm gonna wait for the Meow Ouchers. I really, really want to build that Titan. That's priority number one. Technology acquired. Rad! Focused Arc Emitter. Mm, okay, it's, uh, Sapient Combat AI has become more expensive, again, because of the Empire Sprawl. We were very close to it, remember? <laughs> One point behind. Should we just go and do it? Let's finish it. Okay. Um, Because right now, the endgame crisis can be toggled anyway. So we might as well have the technologies readily available. I mean, it does increase the chances, but everybody suffers when there's an endgame crisis. Not just us. <laughs> we really push the envelope on these ships. Okay, the Cloud Armada is now... 27.7k, and it's only half done. So that's good. Governor Ragutrim has developed new skills. Food from jobs. Good. Good, 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 good. 
I'm gonna wait for the Meow Outers to be upgraded, and then I'm gonna reinforce- I can reinforce them right now, actually. Make me a Titan, please. Please, please. Cruiser. Arrgh, I want the Titan! I want a Titan! Boo-hoo-hoo! <laughs> Do you have the Titan in your queue? No, you don't. <gasps> yes, you do. This tech had up. better generate some up. revenue. Up. Construction complete. Up. Yes. Okay. Sorry. Oh, dear. Rising unemployment on Elmyath. Okay, let's institute the increased benefits. They'll be using more consumer goods. <gasps> we have the sapient combat AI. Let's go for the jump drive now, then. Might as well get everything. So now they're going to have to be upgraded again, of course, to get the Sapient Combat AI. So let's do that. Be glory as well. Get yourselves that Sapient Combat AI, good boys. Oh dear. It's going to be in here, right? Oh yeah. There it is. Ship fire rate plus 15%, tracking plus 30, evasion plus 10%, as opposed to... Boom. Plus 10% fire rate, something. so that's twice as much, sort of, not really. Uh, ship ship weapons range is also complete. 10 to 20%. Cool. Okay, Meow Outers are now at 32.9k. And they're gonna get that Titan, and they're still being upgraded with the Sapient Combat AI. Okay, this will be good for our, um, for our fleets. So I'm I'm not opposed to Technology this. Technology discovered. Rad. Stormfire autocannon has been researched. And now I want the ooh, I don't know. What do I want? Giga cannon? Level two? Giga cannon. Kind of also want the strike craft damage though, but that's a lot of points. Let's go for the giga cannon, because it sounds so big. And then we have Zoblar that has open slots. So let's do the Offworld Trading Company and... What's that? Trader Proxy Office. Galactic Ambition minus 20%. Market fee minus 5? Yes, please. Yalbarasta needs a Naval Logistics Office. And... And, and, and... Disruption Field Generator. We should explore this wormhole. And Iriamun needs a b -b 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 disruption field generator. And what about the defense grid supercomputer? What about this? Produces unity. Deep space black site. Give me that. Where's our only science ship with a person? You. Can you make a point to point jump there, please? Yes. Uh, yeah. And then you go explore that thing. Oh, we also... Boom. Yeah, that's an L gate. We, built something. we still have to open the L gate, too. Oh, we also are still not collecting this. Unless we build a star base there, we won't be able to collect it. But I don't have Ships any cab upgraded. left. Unless I destroy one. Jabba, for example. But I don't want to. Now, I need one more... I need, I need to up my cap. That's what I need to do. Um, Frizzy Hair can build a building. Okay, you have two unemployed workers, so let's work on that. <laughs> Hydroponics farms, then? Um, that was Sheldon laugh, wasn't it? Very scary. You're still being upgraded? That takes forever. Okay, well, you do what you need to do. Hey, why are you there? I don't know why they were left there. Oh, they weren't following, I suppose. There's a void cloud. Oh, this is mine too? I didn't know. Dormon Deer? No, it's not. It's nobody's. Hmm. When, when we have that jump drive, we can go there. We can take it. So, Boom. question is... We built something. Wait, what happened over here? Did you cracks Ross Commonwealth? Ooh, you separated from them. Okay, well, that's your problem, not mine. Can't integrate this into my empire because that will only increase my empire sprawl even further, and it's already pretty big. 
So that's not an option. Wish it had been, but it's not. And Rumis is still building a Titan. Oh! And now Rumianopolis has a worker too, without a jab. But here, enforcers. Are enforcers workers? No, I think soldiers are workers. Enforcers aren't. Um. Boom! We built something. Unless I add more high level jobs so that people can upgrade into a higher sphere. Oh, I'm losing crystals. Okay. Let's try that. Let's see if people upgrade to a higher stratum. Um, why did I not think of that before? That's kind of dumb, isn't it? That's really dumb. Good lord. Um, why am I so stupid sometimes? I need more crystals, though. Um, who is building crystals? Nobody. Why you are why are you not building crystals? I have one more room to spend gases. More declared. Moats? Do I have room to spend more moats? Yes, I do. The beat. I could upgrade this. Oh, crystals again. <laughs> Where? Should I replace this? Because we're not building any robots anymore. Replace it with that thing that makes the crystals. Synthetic crystal plants. Station under attack. Wait, what? Pirates? Really? The unprotected trade route, oh, has attracted the attention of a roving band of pirates. These outlaws have gathered, gathered a sizable fleet that is intercepting much of the system's trade. Sizable, you call that sizable? Hey, can you come and kill them? Any... Okay, fine. Um, You are waiting. So you go kill them, please. Thank you. I was doing important things, though. Now now you, you distracted me from whatever I was doing. That's not nice. I need... Imagine the profit margins on this tech. Do you already have... Ooh, I want the Ministry of Production. Never mind. Uh, food from Jobs has finished. Let's see. Fleet command limit, maybe? And there's an election going. We can only elect one person. Wow. Well, I guess that's going to be a hard choice then. Isn't it? Isn't it? I'm going to have to send a construction ship that way. Because they'll be annoying. You bad, bad people. Okay. We have re-elected our current ruler. Huh, that's, um... Oh! We really push the envelope on these Thank ships. you, friends. Who are you? The Yuxkalok. That's really nice of you. Kill them. Thank you. Good. Good boys. And who's coming in? Oh, more Yuxkalok. We built something. Oh, they're not taking this, though. The pirate nest thing. I have already explained. Reroute the power converter to the auxiliary minefold. No, not that power converter. Ksk. Must I do everything my... Oh, customers. Welcome, please. We bear many goods. We have many wares. All carted safely through the stars for your convenience. Those rats talk fast. We have ore. Rich, luminous ore. Torn right from the stone. Sparkling minerals for the Rumi Corp. But we hunger. We thirst. Grant us 4,000 food and we shall supply your builders, your, mark your makers, with 2,000 minerals. We don't need that. And we don't, we're not gener generating opinion with them, so I don't think, at least. No, thank you. I'll pass. Okay. Now. Boom. We see. built something. Construction complete. Do, 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 do. So I guess I don't need that construction ship. Eh, okay, whatever. Um, mm, 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 mm. you're Boom. fine. We built something. How strong is Arumis? Where is he? where is you? Where is you, Starbase? Nineteen point five k. 
always in my way. Kind of maybe want to build the defensive platforms there. Okay, an urgent missive from Zaktik Zakax explains that a number of no now former members of the racket seek political asylum on the planet. The local administration has seen fit to pass the decision of what to do with them up to the chain of command. You can come in, that's fine. I like the racket, they're nice. Oops. Yeah, vouchers, have you been upgraded yet? Yes, you have. Oh, you can be upgraded again. One ship, though. That's gonna be fast. Fast like. Construction complete! Falmir 2B research station has destroyed a pirate station in the Falmir system and recovered its strong room module. Thank you. Now go back to get upgraded. Oh, you're gonna have to wait till that starbase finishes Construction constructing complete. Um, ships, aren't you? That's that's unfortunate. Oh well, it's fine. Construction complete. When that Titan finishes constructing, oh, we're gonna be awesome. Maybe let's reinforce you. Um, and now, oh. Now I am over 30 minutes already. Oops, I didn't know. Let's read the insult before we end this episode, because I love insults. Behold the sin form, glorious and bared for all to admire. Contrast with the paltry Rumians cowering under their layers of cloth, knowing that the world does not want to see their sad frames. <laughs> Wait, are you insulting us for wearing clothing when, when you're naked? Okay. Okay, I, I appreciate that insult. That's good. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit the like button and please consider subscribing. It helps out immensely. New episodes in Rumi Corp come out on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays at 8 p.m. CET. And I will see you next time.